R. Sengiz Ertekin is a professor of marine hydrodynamics and ocean engineering. He currently holds a guest professor position at Harbin Engineering University of China. He is best known for his contributions to the development of nonlinear water wave theories, hydroelasticity of very large floating structures (VLFS), wave energy, and tsunami and storm impact on coastal bridges. He is also the co-developer, along with Professor H. Ronald Riggs of the University of Hawaii, of the computer program HYDRAN for solving linear fluid structure interaction problems of floating and fixed bodies. Early life and education R. Sengiz Ertekin was born and raised in Turkey. He received a BSc. degree in naval architecture and marine engineering from Istanbul Technical University, the top technical university of Turkey, in 1977. Following the encouragement of his advisor, Professor M. Sengiz Dokmeci, he moved to the Department of Naval Architecture and Offshore Engineering of the University of California at Berkeley, United States, for higher education. He received his MSc. and Ph.D. degrees in 1980 and 1984, respectively. His MSc. advisors were Professors Marshall P. Tulin and William C. Webster. His Ph.D. advisor was Professor John V. Wehausen. Sengiz was the last student of Professor John V. Wehausen before his retirement. After graduation, Professor Wehausen offered Sengiz a postdoctoral research assistant position for 18 months at UC Berkeley. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Professional career. Most of Ertekin's professional career has been dedicated to academic work. However, he also has several years of experience of working in the industry. In 1985, Ertekin joined the research center of Shell Development Company in Houston, Texas. He took a faculty position hired at the associate professor level at the Department of Ocean Engineering of the University of Hawaii at Manoa in 1986, and received tenure within four years and was promoted to professor in 1994. The Ocean Engineering Department of R was established by Professor Charles Brettschneider in 1966 and is one of the first of its kind in USA. At the University of Hawaii, Ertekin led and contributed immensely to the success of SOEST and the Department of Ocean and Resources Engineering or, formerly Ocean Engineering. In the era of PCs, for example, Professor Ertekin played a key role in transferring the department from one focusing mostly on field and experimental studies, to also a leading institute in modern and computational hydrodynamics. The department was the host of some of the internationally leading conferences, workshops and meetings details given below, mostly organized and chaired by Sengiz. After almost 30 years, he retired from the University of Hawaii in September 2015. Starting in March 2014, he became a guest professor at the College of Shipbuilding Engineering of Harbin Engineering University in China. Teaching and advising Ertekin has taught numerous courses on hydrodynamics and ocean engineering at the University of Hawaii at Manoa, and at University of California Berkeley. At the Ocean Engineering Department of the University of Hawaii, Ertekin developed and taught several courses including Nonlinear Water Wave Theories or 707, Hydrodynamics of Fluid Body Interaction or 609, Buoyancy and Stability or 411, and Marine Renewable Energy or 677, to name a few. At the University of California at Berkeley, he taught ship statics NAOE 151 and ship resistance and propulsion NAOE 152A. At the University of Hawaii, Ertekin advised and mentored over 50 graduate students. Topic: Research 
Ertekin's research on marine hydrodynamics and ocean engineering has extended over a period of about 40 years. His work cover both basic and applied research through analytical, computational and experimental approaches. Below are an examples of his pioneering contributions. Other topics of significant research contribution by Ertekin include ship resistance, marine energy, and oil spills. The Green Nadi Water Wave Theory The Green Nadi equations are nonlinear water wave equations that were originally developed by British mathematician Albert E. Green and Iranian American mechanical engineer Paul M. Nadi in the 1970s. C. The original equations, namely the level 1 GN equations, are mostly applicable to the propagation of long waves in shallow waters. However, high-level GN equations are also developed which are applicable to deep water waves. The equations differ from the classical water wave theories e equations, in that the flow need not be a rotational, and that no perturbation is used in deriving the equations. Hence, the GN equations satisfy the nonlinear boundary conditions exactly, and postulate the integrated conservation laws. Although the GN equations were developed very recently, compared to other wave theories, they are well known and fairly understood by the research and scientific community. Ertekin's PhD advisor and dissertation committee chair was Professor Wehausen. Others on his PhD committee were Professor William Webster, and Professor Paul M. Nadi. Working under close guidance of his advisors, he was one of the first to use the nonlinear equations that were introduced just a couple of years earlier by profs. Green and Nadi. In his PhD dissertation, Ertekin was the first to give the equations in now a familiar form to the hydrodynamics community by providing closed form relations for the pressures. He named the equations, the Green-Nadi equations. Upon completion of his PhD, Ertekin continued research on the GN equations. He has patiently introduced the GN equations to his graduate students and postdoctoral researchers and has guided many of them to perform basic and applied research on or by use of the GN equations. Along with his research assistant and postdocs, they developed the irrotational GN IGN equations CEG, and, and high-level GN equations CEG, and. They have solved some of the classical and challenging hydrodynamics problems by use of the GN equations, including nonlinear wave diffraction and refraction CEG, nonlinear wave loads on vertical cylinders CEG, wave interaction with elastic bodies and VLFS CEG, wave loads on coastal bridges CEG, and wave interaction with wave energy devices CEG, among many others. Topic. Hydroelasticity and VLFS The Mobile Offshore Base MOB project of USA and the Mega Float Project of Japan are two examples of very large floating structures VLFS. These are very large floating platforms consist of interconnected modules whose length can extend to several kilometers. Due to the unprecedented long length, displacement and associated hydroelastic response of VLFS, the state-of-the-art analysis and design approaches that was used for smaller floating platforms was not adequate. It quickly became obvious that new approaches must be developed to tackle the complex problems associated to dynamics and response of VLFS. Starting 1990s, Ertekin pioneered the research on hydroelasticity of VLFS. He and H. Ronald Riggs of the Civil Engineering Department at the University of Hawaii coined the term VLFS. They have solved the hydroelasticity problem of VLFS by use of both linear and nonlinear approaches, in two and three dimensions. Ertekin has also introduced new approaches and equations to study this topic, including the use of nonlinear water wave models to analyze the hydroelastic response of VLFS of MAT type CEG, and his work and research on hydroelasticity of VLFS has opened a new era for these topics and gave more confidence in understanding the dynamics and response of the structures. <laughs> 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 
Topic: <laughs> Wave loads on coastal bridges. Some of the recent tsunami and hurricanes, such as Tohoku tsunami in Japan 2011 and Hurricane Katrina in the United States 2005, caused significant damage to the decks of coastal bridges and structures. Interaction of surface waves with coastal bridges is a complex problem, involving fluid structure interaction, multi-phase fluids, wave breaking, and overtopping. These are of course in addition to the difficulties associated to the structural analysis. Ertekin and his students studied bridge failure mechanisms and possible mitigating solutions. They developed models used to assess the vulnerability of coastal bridges in USA to tsunami and storm surge and waves. <laughs> Publications and professional services Ertekin has over 150 peer-reviewed publications, he has been on the editorial board of more than 10 internationally leading journals since early 1990s CEG, and, an editor of several special issues in various journals, CEG Renewable Energy, Leveraging Ocean and Waterways Special Issue of Applied Ocean Research Journal 2009. He was the co-editor in chief of Elsevier's Ocean Engineering Journal 2006 to 2010 and he is the founding editor in chief of Springer's Journal of Ocean Engineering and Marine Energy. Ertekin has been keynote speaker of several leading meetings and conferences CEG and <laughs>